In this program, we're going to learn about biomes. A biome is the largest geographic biotic unit, a major community with similar life forms and environmental conditions. There are terrestrial or land biomes. And there are aquatic biomes, both freshwater and marine. Scientists disagree on how to divide up the Earth's biomes. So, we'll take a look at five major biomes. Aquatic biomes include freshwater ecosystems, including lakes, ponds, rivers, and streams. Freshwater wetlands are areas of standing water that cover the soil. The marine biome is the world's largest biome. It includes the five main oceans, gulfs, and bays. Over one million species of plants and animals have been discovered in the oceans. Coral reefs are found in clear, tropical oceans. The sun is the source of energy for the coral reef ecosystem. An estuary is an ecosystem where seawater mixes with freshwater. Estuaries are found along the coast. Desert biomes cover about 20% of the Earth's surface. There are both hot and cold deserts. Few animals and plants have adapted to the dry desert life. Antarctica is the largest desert in the world, while the Sahara is the largest hot desert. Forest biomes can be divided into several forest ecosystems. There are tropical rainforests that are hot, dense, and wet all year long. Temperate rainforests are wet too, but can get a lot cooler. The chaparral is very hot and dry. Chaparral plants have large, hard leaves to hold moisture. The animals are mainly grassland and desert types. The taiga, also known as the coniferous forest, is the largest terrestrial biome on Earth. The most common type of trees are cone-bearing trees. Animals living in the taiga have adapted to the cold climate. Grassland biomes include the savanna. The savanna is comprised of mostly grasses and a few scattered trees and a wide variety of animals. The most important plants in the temperate grasslands are grasses. The dominant vertebrates in grasslands are herbivorous or plant-eating grazers. The coldest biome on Earth is the tundra. Located in the Arctic Circle surrounding the North Pole, many lichens, mosses, and small shrubs grow there. Caribou and polar bears are just a few of the animals that have adapted to the harsh climate. The Earth has many different biomes. Complex communities with varying abiotic or non-living and biotic or living components.